What's up guys, it's Eduardo here and I'm gonna be interviewing some triggers. I'm here with Aiden Kennedy from Philadelphia. So, which tricker is the best battler in your opinion? You can I don't know say um, Aiden Kennedy. <laughs> no, no. Um, this man's one hooked. Jam. What else have you won? Loop kicks. Loop kicks. Uh, I, I a bunch probably of. Probably still say show say. Okay. Even though he beat him at jam, who's the best battler? Danny. <laughs> no. Um. Definitely Aiden. Aiden's killing it. The best battler. Aiden. Aiden or Mike. Either Jacob Pinto or Aiden Kennedy. Aiden Kennedy. Either Aiden again or the Takahashi brothers. Takahashi brothers. They put on a show no matter what. Oh yeah. Always sync. Always sync. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They build off each other. <laughs> Must be because they're like related or something. Best battler. Ooh, that's a tough one too, man. Aiden Kennedy made zero mistakes today as far as I'm concerned like you know there's sometimes there's a little hiccup or a redirect and stuff but he was pretty much everything that he had intentions of doing he actually mm -hmm. completed and he executed everything really well and so I'd say just for his consistency alone like and the fact that he can just do variated triple folds at the end of a combo I'm like that's like actually tight like he's not holding back endurance. he's not holding back yeah, yeah he, he was out there either Pinto or Mike I'd go with Mike overall Jacob Pinto okay yeah I have to go with Shose. I think he just, even though he lost that jam. Mm, yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. It happens. I mean, Pinto is really strong. I wouldn't say like, like I'd say he's not in his prime. You know, like many other trickers right now, and that's fine. But in his prime, Pinto, I think honestly takes it. Maybe sometimes he would get out difficult by Johan if Johan would do like three two or something like at hooked a couple years ago. Mm -hmm. But Watching Pinto battle is just, I don't know, it's, it's, it's kind of horrifying. It's hype. It's, it's hype. It's like going up against that would be very hard. Like yeah. I, would, I would have no idea what to do. Truth. I like to watch Zen. Zen is probably really good at battling. Would you like to battle Zen in the future? Yes, I would really love to battle Zen. You think you could beat him? That's a really hard one. I, I think I could give him a neck-to-neck -neck battle because with my style, I think I could at least try to get him a little bit scared. Ethan Turner is my favorite to watch battling, probably. He's just a vicious little passion monster. He just wants it so badly, and he throws down. He normally doesn't pick up in battles. Um, he normally stomps at least one quad each battle. He's battled with Mike at Dub Dub Surd lately. I watched him battle throughout the entire tour. He's just a monster. Zen and Shosei, I watch battle a lot, too, and they are kind of like they only defeat each other. Well, Shosei only defeats Zen, but yeah, either Shosei, but Ether Tur is probably my favorite, but yeah, Shosei is probably the best battler out right now. All right. Or, now, oh, Aiden Kennedy. Aiden Kennedy, because he just is like a, he's like elite at 15. He's not like, Shosei's got crazy power and he's insane and he's innovating higher than anybody else probably but Aiden's got like all the empty spaces filled with tricking so he's definitely the the hardest contender because he just beat Shosei at jam as well so and we're gonna watch him battle tonight too so that's a loaded question because obviously battling has plenty of different styles and it, it also comes down to who's judging um, as far as who can I think of all time, who knows how to answer what the judges want and do tricks that are honest to them. I have to say, either Johan or Jacob Pinto. Yes. And um, mainly because Johan goes out there and he's having fun doing stuff that he knows he can do, but also is like super exciting to watch. Yes. But Jacob Pinto, you you either hate him or you love him. But his energy that he brings to a battle, if you know nothing about tricking and you vibe strictly off of what he's doing, you're like, mm -hmm. this is crazy. He, you, you like, like some people are like, can you do a backflip? And then you do a cork, and they're like, I don't know what the, you know what I mean. Like yeah. they they wouldn't know. But if you watch Jacob Pino's energy and you know nothing about tricking, you're like, oh, something just happened. Yeah, yeah. That man can put on a show for sure. Absolutely. Oh yeah. All right. So now rank your three favorite trickers, like in order. Um, 